Good morning, this is Erin from Saddle Feathers Farm, and we have Clarissa here from Mount Olympus Farm, mm -hmm. and we're processing birds as you can see. Uh, we're doing quail. Clarissa's got a really good video on how to do meat birds, meat chickens. We're doing quail this morning and some meat chickens also. Um, since we don't have a video on quail, we're just going to make a quick one on how to do that. Uh, first, we... I've already dispatched them because I don't think YouTube likes that. With some clippers, you just hold them over a bucket, cut their heads off, let them bleed out, and that's what we have here. So quail are a little different from chickens as far as plucking. You don't have to scald them. You just pull the feathers in the same direction, and they come out really easily. Their skin does tear easily, as we've found over here. So you can skin them if you want. <laughs> they do dry out a little easier if you do skin them. So we've got them mostly plucked now. I left the wings on um, because they're so hard to pluck it'll tear the skin. So we're just going to remove the wings because there's, there's really not much meat on the wings anyway. So I'm just going to remove it at the elbow joint. Throw it in the cooler here. Sure. Just removing the wings there. I still have a few more feathers to pick off of this one, but I'll show you how I gut them. Clarissa did it a different way, the same way as the chickens, and just cut in the abdomen and pulled out that way. I find it easier to cut their spine out, essentially, and then you pull everything out with the spine. So I'm cutting down the spine with just a pair of scissors because their bones are super delicate. So they just snip right out. So there's one side and cut down the other side. Just grab the spine and pull, and everything kind of comes out with it. Or supposed to. This one didn't, of course. <laughs> My video lies. <laughs> All right, so we got that out, and we'll just cut around the vent, because you don't want any, any of the intestinal juices on the meat. So we just cut that right out. The intestines and everything, kind of one clump. Pretty cool. So there we have what it looks like when you get everything out. It's just kind of empty. And that's called, in chickens it's called spatchcocking, I think. Yep. You take it out and then you kind of cook it flat. It takes a lot less time to cook that way too, but I'm not sure how we're going to cook these yet. We might wrap them in bacon or something fun. Yeah. 